Mama, go see Mama. She's over there. She's ordering our food. Yeah, go. Guys, I think he's scared to go over there. Uh oh, he's actually going. Oh. There we go. What's, What's up, up, YouTube? YouTube? Welcome, Welcome back, back to our, our channel. channel. It's your boy Sam. Carlisa. And this is Silas. <laughs> What's up guys? We got the whole family back. They just got back from their grandmother spending a good week over there. We rarely get breaks, but now they are back. And that time wasn't even a break because we didn't even do nothing. We were so busy. As you guys can see by the title, yes, we are trying Indian food again. We had so many comments on our previous video and you guys wanted us to try Indian street food. So here we are today trying Indian street food. We finally found a place here in Alpharetta, Georgia. It was looked so crazy. So we were like, we definitely have to come here and try it. So I'm very excited. And once again, I am very hungry, very, very hungry. So I don't want to do too much talking. I want to get right into this video and get my drink on and get my foodie on because I'm ready to go. All right, guys. So let's get right into this video and try this Indian street food. Let's, let's go. go. Alright guys, so this is how it all came in. It's nice big bag neat. Of goodies. Yes, nice, neat, and precise in here. So it looks pretty good. Let's see. Uh-oh, what's in there? Oh, Silas, what's in that bag? We got a couple things. Oh, oh. Uh, this says chicken. Mm -hmm. So we did get Indian chicken tacos. Mm, guys. We're That's something new that we haven't tried yeah, yet. Yeah, we never tried this before. We never tried any of this, but um, I'm not 100% sure if this is like a very popular street food in India. Comment down below and let us know. And guys, also don't forget to give us a thumbs up on this video. And don't forget if you haven't already to subscribe to our channel and join the family. Sorry guys, the kids are all over yeah, me Yeah, right it's alright, so I got it. <laughs> but we oh, appreciate you guys. Alright. So this is the next thing. So, yeah, you can hey, open it and show them the chicken oh, tacos. Open. Papa, show them the chicken open. tacos. Open. Was there a specific name or just chicken tacos? It just said, yeah, it just said chicken oh. tacos. Oh, you got to show them that. This is our chicken tacos, guys, as you guys can see. Looks very good. Mm. has a lot of vegetables in there, some cheese, yeah. and it looks like some homemade bread. What's that? This homemade bread? Mm. Oh, that's sure, the naan. Papa. Okay, that's Another way. Naan. You got to put them in this camp. Yeah. And that's our naan right there. Pyro just showed you guys. Pop, can you say naan? All right, guys, so I just wanted to go back to the menu and just double check what was on these tacos just so you guys can see. Um, they are made with corn tortillas, pico, and cachumber. Um, I'm not sure what that is. I don't know. But um, it also looks like there's um, vegetables in here. There's like some type of cheese, onions, the pico de gallo, and looks like some peppers maybe in here. So this is how the chicken tacos look. And Those get, look very, very good. And again, guys, I mean, I guess it's called street food because it's quick food, I guess. Maybe. I don't know why it's called street food. Interesting. Just make it up. Comment, guys, comment down below. Why is it called Indian street food? I mean, every culture has street food. Well, I, like, what is street food? Like, like street food. Like, Americans probably like fried Oreos, like, just stuff like that. Oh, okay, okay. Cheese fries. Silas is just back there, so he's just doing whatever he's doing back there. Um, he's moving around a little bit too much, as you guys know. He's already eating. Yeah. Again, guys, as you know, when we film videos with them, there are a lot, lots going on. So just try to, you know, stay with us. <laughs> just stay with us and bear with us. All right, All right so this next. one right here is going to be the Samoa, Samosa, Samosa. Samosa. Ooh, so I remember are, those. Yeah, these are going to be something like a fried empanada type of thing. Mm. And let me just double check what these are made. Cairo. Wait a second. These are going to be flaky hand breaded, flaky handmade empanadas like pastries stuffed with curry potatoes with chutney sauces. Guys, look at this. It's huge too. It might look small on camera, but like guys, it's That's huge. Look at it, it's huge. Yeah, these are huge. <laughs> So they gave us two of them, and they gave us like a red chutney sauce right here. Ooh, or, I don't know. It was kind of like I don't a think dark, there's red chutney. I don't know, like a dark one. And then they also gave us a green one. Um, I don't think we've ever tried these before for the Indian culture. I'm actually excited for this street food. It did. It, it just, it's a different feel. 
And then looking at it makes me super hungry. I think already, we're gonna guys. save we're gonna save this last one and not show you guys until after we eat these ones. Okay. So we're gonna save these ones. Alright guys, so we're gonna try the samosas first. Yeah. We got two sauces. Did you wanna try the sauces too? Sai. Oh, I'm excited to try hey, this man. last one. Hey little man, what are you doing back there? Are you ready to eat? Hold on, wait. I guess so. We also got a drink, guys. So we just wanted to try one of these drinks. This one is called a ginger mint lemonade. I'm not sure if that's like only Indian culture or like this is just how I they make it. You can actually see all the mint too, guys. On yes, the you guys can like see the ginger. I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, the ginger and the mint on the, the bottom sauce. of it. Um, it looks a little thick on the bottom, but it looks pretty good. So we're gonna dive into the samosas, Samoas. And the, what is it? The chicken taco. All right, guys, he was getting super excited, so he's trying it now. He's already eating it. He just, he's we just gave him the whole too. thing because he's going crazy. Let me try this thing. Yes, guys, so this is the Samoas again mm. with the potato chutney or something inside. Definitely see all the potatoes in there. Look at that. Mmm. Oh, Let me sweet. try one of the sauces. Let me try some. Let me take another bite. They're eating it. Mmm. <laughs> That's pretty good. Alright guys, so I'm going to taste that. Mm, it's good? Mmm. <gasps> guys, there's peas in here. There is? There's peas in here, guys. Oh, there is. I didn't even pay attention to that. Not not um, saying that I don't like it because of peas. It's just peas are my least favorite. You probably just ate vegetable. like four of them. Uh, it tastes good though, I mean. Yeah. I, can, I can barely I'm taste it. Let me taste one of those sauces, though. Yeah, I'll give you the red. This is definitely a very, it's a little spicy now that um, the spice is kicking in for me. Um, is this, it's just like ma mashed potatoes, uh, spices, peas, maybe lentils or something like that. I'm not 100% sure. Try that dipping sauce. They didn't really say all the ingredients that's in here, so we really have no idea. Oh, that's a drippy sauce. Mm. Let me get some bread. No. Mm. Mm. Let me try the other sauce. I can't have the bread, dude. You're hogging all the bread. Let me try the other sauce. Oh, that sauce is very sweet. Let me try the other sauce before this one spills. Poppy, wanna try some? Mm. Here's that. Oh, yeah. guys, I don't know what this sauce is, but it's very, very, very sweet. All right, guys, the kids are in the back. We try to bring them back. They're doing way too much. Let's resume this food review. All right, guys. So I'm gonna taste this green sauce, and Sammy's gonna taste that as well. The first sauce that we had, I have no idea what it is. is It was very sweet. It was very. It was really, really, really good. So really if you guys good. know what that type of sauce is, they didn't tell us what sauce, and it's not anywhere on any of these papers here. And we haven't so tried please, that yet. Please tell us what that sauce is down there. I'm gonna show you guys an up close of it as well. But we're dipping in this green, green sauce. sauce. Oh, that's really spicy. No, it's not spicy. It's At the ginger. end, it's spicy. It's ginger. And yeah, that's what I was saying too. At the end, it's definitely mm. spicy. It has a kick to it too. Woo! This is a green. Oh, okay, now I taste it. It's a green ginger sauce. Mm. The sauces are good with it, but I, I don't know. I'm just, I'm not really a big fan. They're okay, but would I might get them? Would I get them again? Probably not. But if these were stuffed with like chicken or something else, I would definitely dig in. Really? I really, I genuinely really love these a lot. I actually do. I can bypass the peas in there because I can't really taste it at all or the texture of it. Um, I would like if there was like some cheese in here or like some tomatoes or something just to give it a little bit extra flavor. The flavor is a little bit bland. Um, but it's a little spicy at the same time. And these sauces, I definitely feel like these sauces are needed and they taste a lot like 10 times better, especially with this sauce. Oh my gosh, it all that just fell in, just there. in there. <laughs> all of her potatoes just went in there. Oh my. Mm. It's good? No, it's super good. You no. really like this. She really, she loves that, y'all. Mm. I give that to her. No, I like this a lot. I'm not going to lie. All right, guys, let's dig into these tacos. They did have a vegan uh, option as well, too, but uh, we know we got our you good old chicken. chicken. Um, these look very good again if you want to show them again. Look at that, guys. That's that how looks, they look inside. That looks really good. Hey, you can try this one. All right. I pray you like it. Ugh. 
There's a lot of vegetables in here, guys. So you know me and my vegetables. I'm gonna just pick this off too. Just eat it with it, and if it, you don't like it, then just take it off, man. You always do that. I see little potatoes now. I'm really a big fan of potatoes. Hey, this just onion you're, too? you're missing the whole point though of the taco. Oh my gosh. Mm. Guys, that chicken is so pure and good. Mmm. Mmm. Everything flows together. The onions. Is this masala, I believe? Tiki masala? This one I taste. I don't know. We don't know what's in here. Like I said, it just said the cucumber. I don't know. Cucumber or something like that. And pico that's all it said on here so we don't really know it's like, it looks like a cojita cheese or something maybe an indian cheese i'm mm. not sure the little white specks guys but there's like peppers and stuff in here too whatever this is guys everything that they put in here mm. it flows very good i didn't pick many vegetables off but just a little bit and everything is just mm. Mm, guys. And one thing mm. i can say about these tacos though is that they're not spicy no really this is the first piece of the, food. The first Indian thing food. that we've had in a very long, well, like that's not spicy. Yes. To be honest, this is a this is the first non-spicy Indian taco or whatever food product that we had from India. Mhm. Mm that was that's not spicy. It's not spicy. It's not spicy at all. Guys, the tortilla or whatever it is, the that's breading is homemade. This is this is amazing. It's great. I personally don't feel it's homemade. I feel it's like a store bought, and, and I was gonna say that's the only thing I really don't like about the taco. Yeah. So as y'all can see, that's how it looks, and I feel like that's I feel like that's kind of like the store quality of the tacos, taco shows. But I mean, I feel like that's more of like the Latin culture for that type of stuff. So I wouldn't, you know, take off any points for that though. Guys, I like everything about the taco. If you don't mind, let me get that last taco. <laughs> that taco was amazing. Mm. Literally, every time I go get street Indian food, I'm going to get tacos. That was really, really good. That was a really good taco. And if I have the option to switch chickens in there, like maybe butter garlic chicken. Mm, different types of chicken. That would be good, too. Tiki mm. masala chicken. That would be so great. I'm definitely going to mix and match my combinations. Yeah, that was really good. Mm. Mm. So after those two things, we did want to take a break real fast because we are very thirsty. So we did want to tap into this, what was it? Ginger, Ginger mint, mint lemonade. lemonade. So the kids were already acting antsy when, as soon as I showed this to them. So we had to pause. Um, so they both already tasted it. They didn't give any weird faces or anything. So that means that they probably like it. Cairo um, gave a weird face. Oh, he did. I didn't see him. <laughs> it just looked like very gingery to him. That's what it yeah. looked like. Yeah. All right. So let's try this and see how it goes. I'm going to mix this in the bottom. That looks a little like a bit lot thick. of ginger in there. Yes. All right. Let's go. I don't like that look. Go ahead. I'm scared, guys. Oh my gosh. It's way too overpowering of ginger. Maybe we weren't supposed to mix it. Maybe we we're supposed to leave it on the bottom. But then it's gonna be sucked from the bottom. That is true. Guys, um, it's very, all you taste is ginger. You can barely taste the lemonade. Um, but it, there's no like lemonade taste either. It's like a little bit watery. Maybe that's how they made yeah, it or but all i taste again. is literally ginger going right in my mouth i can't drink that no. <laughs> yeah i feel like i feel like it's not it's not bad it's not bad but i feel like this cup is too small for the amount that they have Definitely. in here i feel Perfectly like i said. feel like if they like in like a bigger cup mm -hmm. and have more of the actual lemonade mm -hmm. Then I feel like it would it would evenly mix it out. I feel like it's just too much. Like I, I can't even taste cup. the mint. I yeah, can, I can't taste no, the I mint can, at I all. No, I can taste the mint. I can taste the mint. Just a little bit, I guess. Taste it one more time. Oh, guys, I'm sorry. I'm not a fan. <laughs> he took a <laughs> he took a tiny sip. I'm not. I'm not a fan. I, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. No, it's just, I, it it's just not needs to, my to be tasting. more lemonade in here. More yeah. lemonade. Yes. We saved the last item for you guys. 
We picked this one out. We we're most excited about off the menu. I don't even know what this looks like, so yeah. Go ahead. I'm about to just pull it out. Open right pull now. it out. Okay, so Ooh. this one is Panny Puri. I don't even know if I said that right. Because the guy did correct me when I ordered it. <laughs> <laughs> so this one right here. Guys, look at that. Look at how this one looks. They look like have, dough balls. So the Penny Puri is hollow semen, semolina puree potato garba, garbanzo mash cumin terramid water. So I have no idea, nothing by the base of how that looks. I have no idea how this is going to taste at all. I, I have um, no so worries. I'm just ready I'm to ready taste it. I'm ready to taste it. That's a lot of stuff in one little... Panty or period. We don't even, I have it. no idea what this is. <laughs> All right, so here's yours. So you can show them up close and how and look, it guys, looks. they look very fragile. So if you guys choose to get one of these, just be careful so yeah, you don't smash fragile. it. Yeah, very fragile. But this so is it. So this is a garbanza that they were talking about. That's what we did in it? Um, garbanza. What is the garbanza? It's the beans. Oh. They garbanza beans. Oh. So this is how, whatever this is in here. I have no idea what this is. That looks crazy. Yeah. It looks like there's chickpeas in there too. Those look like chickpeas. That's, that's what it is. Oh. Cumin tearmid water. <laughs> <coughs> that caught me off a surprise. <laughs> so do we dip this in here? I believe so. I mean, we got to try it. I mean, guys, the smell is really like not pleasing but hey you know let's try it i guess and guys we didn't look up how to eat this so we're doing this just straight off of our minds um so we're just gonna try it with what we think of how to eat it cheers it let's cheers it like i said it's not that bad but that smell uh -uh. i was very scared but mm, yeah, oh i think God. I have no idea. Don't eat that out. No. What? You don't want me to break it? Put that on there. That's what I was gonna do. But guys, the outer shell. I, guys, it's what, like I have no idea what that. I mean, I it, it said what it was, but I don't know like what it really is for real. Guys, it's like a a baked bread ball with nothing inside. So I'm gonna save this. How do you even make these? It's interesting. Look at them. Oh, it is. Yeah. What is that? All right. What's it smell like? You like it? Yeah. It's good, right? Oh, yeah. He's just confused as he us. He said orange. He's confused as we are too. He said. <laughs> All right, so I put the garbanzo beans with the cheese and it looks like ginger sauce or something. I'm gonna show him how that looks. Oh, there we go. All right, so I put some of this in here just to see how it's gonna taste. Yeah, it tastes. I'm about to say you gotta kind of eat the whole thing. It's small. What's going on? It's not bad. All right, guys. So I did it my way. I put. Oh no! I believe you're supposed to put it inside, but I put it on top. <laughs> guys, I, I know this. It doesn't even look like the right way or seem like the right way, but I'm gonna still try it like this. We just had to switch to the phone. We're buying a new memory card very soon. Yes, we are. The card is full of videos and just pictures, pictures. and just a lot of other stuff. Yes. But back to this, it's actually pretty good. It's like a little appetizer. Um, we didn't try it with ev it, all the sauce, but yeah, I don't even know how to explain it. Let me try it with the one sauce. Inspired by the legends. Mm, it's pretty good. It's just like a little, I don't even it's know how to super, explain super it. It's super, super thin and very, very crunchy. Um, it's very delicate. I'm not really sure what to compare it to. Um, some type of like very like highly, thin, very, very thin baked, chip type chip of big chip or something right? like I don't that. Know. But just like puffed into a ball. Um, I'm pretty sure it's some type of like mixture like fried and where it puffs up, but I don't know what that is. I've never tasted that before. Um, it was unique. This, I liked it. For th that's this though. Yeah, yes, this was this. this was actually really good. Everything was really really good in here. It has like potatoes, cheese, the beans, and maybe some other type of things in here. But this wasn't bad for real. It was okay. To this me. sauce, I did not like the smell of it, and it was cool. But I didn't really see the point of like dipping it in here. Um, I'm not sure if we're supposed to wait till it gets soggy or whatever. But I don't know. But I would definitely say 
that was okay. It was my favorite. Uh, what would you say would be your favorite? I'm assuming the tacos. Uh, definitely the tacos, the chicken, everything was seasoned well. I, I like the tacos the best. Everything about it was good. My favorite would be the chicken taco, the Samoas, and then the last, the Penny Perry. But all this for our first time trying Indian street food, I think it was pretty good. I give it like an eight. I give it overall eight. I give it a. I'll give it an eight overall too. It's very, very different from all the other Indian dishes that we had. If you need a quick bite, this would definitely be feeling and good. And I was I was definitely satisfied. Um, I would love to try some other different types of Indian street food as well. But once again, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any other video ideas that you guys would like us to do, make sure you comment down below. Hello. Any other food reviews, challenges, or any other type of things that we can incorporate into our vlog. Definitely let us know and help us out. We really appreciate you guys again, and we'll see you guys in our next video. Thanks again. Peace Bye. out.